Hey everybody, hope you're having an awesome day. We're back here in Dragonvale, and today we're going to be showing you how to breed the Iridescent Dragon. It's a rare elemental hybrid dragon. Came out with three other light hybrid dragons on January 25th, 2017, and it's available in your park at level 21. Uh, we have a quick screen we'll show you, which is uh, one of the loading screens. Shows all three dragons and they're pretty awesome looking dragons and we can go check them out here in the social tab in the news and they're down here at the bottom all three and the iridescent dragons the last one so you tap the info and you get your info screen you can also go check them out in the goals and there it is right there at the top and also you can see them in the market you go into the market, type your dragons, and let's see if we see them right at the first. Oh, they slide over a bit. Uh, the other two aren't there, but you can uh, use a filter to find them. But here's our iridescent dragon. And you can see it's 1,675 gems to buy. The two elements are light and air. It starts at 8 dragon cash a minute, and it's got a 13-hour incubation time or 13 hour breed time. Uh, if you do have the upgraded cave or the island it will be uh, 10 hours and 24 minutes. And the info on the dragon is nominative determinism at work. There's a couple of words that are a little tough to get out. The aptly named Iris Chroma just so happens to be an expert in light magic color theory. Her work with Interfero magic, oh, another big word, and chromoillumination spells culminated in a method of unveiling certain dragons that appear to be invisible in all but direct sunlight. Thanks to Iris clever, Iris's clever charm work, the iridescent dragon's beauty is now in the eye of every beholder, no matter the weather. Uh, so it's a pretty cool looking dragon. I wouldn't say if it's, say it's actually a beautiful dragon. Um, I kind of like the look of the other two a bit more, but here's the iridescent dragon nonetheless. And uh, we got it in the park, and we're going to go check it out right now, over here in the nursery. There it is, the very first egg. And we got it with this combo right here in the cave, which is the light riff and a snow dragon. And we got it, I think, on the second try. It didn't take too many tries uh, before we actually got the Iridescent Dragon from this combo. Uh, both these dragons are level 20. And we also got, as you can see, the other two light hybrid dragons. The, um, uh, the uh, Candescent and the Fluorescent Dragon here in the nursery as well. But let's hatch the iridescent dragon and put it into a light habitat. We got a spot right over here for it. And here comes the iridescent dragon looking pretty cool. And then we get a, a couple of gems from Twitter and Facebook. One and two. And we got a bit of XP there. Oh, a bunch of stuff, then we cashed out the habitat. So let's go level up the iridescent dragon. See, it starts at nine dragon cash a minute. Uh, and if you have a boost on the island, we have a light boost there, so it'll be a bit higher. Uh, it goes up to 96 at level 20. 96 dragon cash a minute at level 20. It might be a bit higher with the boost. At level 16 right now. 17, 18, and level 20, so up to 115 with the boost, which is pretty cool. And there's the adult iridescent dragon. I'll turn off the crown here, and let's go check it out in the park. And he's a good sized dragon, he's a bigger dragon than uh, most of the other dragons, definitely bigger than this metal dragon right here in the front. This guy. And uh, what I like to do, I think I'm going to put the other two 
light hybrid dragons in the habitat and we can see them all together but before I do that a few other combos that you can try uh, if you don't have a light rift or a snow handy uh, you can try an air and a light of course which are the base, the main elements for this dragon uh, a halo and a hypnotic uh, is a good combo uh, you can try a light and a blizzard are also good combos and you can try those combos in the co-op breeding cave if you don't have both dragons handy you can find a friend with the dragon you need and co-op breed with them that'll also work as well uh, the halo and the hypnotic dragon uh, worked in co-op and a few other combos uh, people have used have worked in co-op as well so co-op will work if you don't have the dragons handy and your friends have the dragon but let's go get the other two dragons right over here we're eventually going to get to the nursery uh, let's hatch this one and we just got to speed it up a little bit so we're going to get the fluorescent dragon and put it into the habitat and for more information on the fluorescent dragon you can check out uh, the other video on the fluorescent dragon but let's level up this new fluorescent dragon and we'll go up to level 15 here Number 12, 14, and there's level 15 with the fluorescent dragon. And we're going to go grab the other candescent dragon and put that in there as well. So it'll be cool seeing all three of the new light hybrid dragons in the one habitat. And here comes the candescent dragon. And we'll hatch the candescent dragon. Now the candescent dragon we got with the light rift and the snow combo as well in the breeding cave and the fluorescent dragon we got in the island with the light and the blizzard dragon you can see the combo right over here uh, right over here it was a a light dragon and a blizzard dragon that's what we got the fluorescent dragon with and gotta go find the light island there we are and we go level up our candescent dragon quickly here. Now with all these combos, if you don't have uh, a level 20 dragon or uh, an elder version of the light dragon, uh, level up the dragons as high as you can and breed with those dragons. And just keep, keep going until you get the dragon. Uh, now all these dragons are permanent dragons, so you can... Take your time breeding them if you want to if you want to go breed a different dragon and come back to it you know it doesn't matter you can just breed whenever uh, you're able to and hopefully you'll get it into the park and you can see the candescent dragon is on the small side and the fluorescent dragons on the small side too so the largest dragon out of the three is the iridescent dragon Cool, I don't know if we're going to be able to see them all at the same time. They're sort of, there they are. There's a good look at them if the sand dragon put his wing down. So there's all three of them in the park, looking pretty cool. And the other thing you can do is also put any of those three dragons uh, up in your co-op. Just select the dragon, hit the blue heart, and you uh, may get a twin of that dragon if one of your friends decides to breed with that dragon. You can also put the light dragon up in co-op the same way uh, and your friends may breed with that dragon which might result in a twin dragon uh, of any of these three dragons. So the XP earned on the iridescent dragon was 350,000 XP. Uh, if you do get a few extra iridescent dragons if you get lucky enough, uh, you can sell them for 2,500,000 dragon cash, which is a, a good, huge amount of dragon cash. And I'll just leave you with a description of Iridescent. It's uh, basically displaying a play of lustrous colors like those of the rainbow. And you can see in the tail and on the head and just that little spike on the back, you got a few rainbow colors 
going on there. So I guess that's the iridescent part of the iridescent dragon. So good luck getting this dragon into your park. Hope it doesn't take you very long and your combos work for you. Uh, that's it for this video. Thanks for watching. Please leave a like or a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe for more videos from Dragonvale. And we'll see you guys next time.